Hey guys, it's FireSnakeX8 here, and welcome back to some more Legend Zelda Wind Waker HD. Last time, we went upon Tetris Boat and got ourselves the delivery bag. So, uh, now we, uh, we're here in the Forsaken Fortress to go save our sister, which is up there where the sequels are. So, um, this area is basically based upon stealth. So you're, nece uh, so you're supposed to be picking up those barrels over there. And each time you drop, you just, like, become a hidden barrel kind of thing. So, basically, what our objective is, is we're going to be turning off these searchlights. And if you... Okay, so, see, if they come upon contact, you should just stop, and they won't see you. And let's just hopefully hurry up. So, that's technically what... Oh, see, they found us, so we get thrown in jail. And, it's actually a good thing, because there's a heart piece around here somewhere. I just don't remember where it is, because it's been a while, but, hey, alright. So we're just going to throw away this pot over here. And note that it's not optional, but you have to come here if you want to get the heart piece. So, let's just turn around here, and let's hurry up. It's going to take a while. Turning in. Come on, my, my controller's not responsive. Okay, now. So, here we are. Where we originally were. Uh, where, that's where we originally were. And now, we're going to go over here and get our first chest. And, what is it? It's the dungeon map. Alright. So, what we're going to do now we're just gonna drop here and oh yeah I forgot to mention you don't have your sword here and this displays another mechanic where oh see you, you have to just ignore the enemies here right now you can't attack them unless if you want to throw things at them so here we are we get our first heart piece spoiled open still who cares our first heart piece Alright, so, yeah, basically you need four um, heart pieces in order to get a heart container. So we'll get four. Oh. So you don't uh, want the moblins to spot us, so we're just gonna wait here. And... Hopefully, oh, I'm gonna look around. So... If you ever hear that noise, that means that he's about to look. Or she, I, it's he though, so... Yeah. Oh. So you don't want to get caught because you'll get thrown in jail. So you're just supposed to wait for them to move. Hurry up. Oh, that's scary. Alright. So technically, you're just playing the role of Solid Link. Get it? Solid Snake, Solid Link. Okay, I'm done. Alright, so we're just gonna drop this here, and we're gonna make a run for it, and head up here. Now, I uh, just want to ignore it, because there's gonna be some mini blends here. And here's a map of the Forsaken Fortress, but nobody wants that. Because you just have a map on your screen. Your gamepad screen, that is. And I'm just trying to look weird head right now. Let's just go here. Unless if we've been heading in circles, which... Uh, wait. What am I doing? Okay, here we are. Let's just head over here. And... Alright. So, none of the moblins have spotted us. Oh, there we go. This part is like... I really don't like this um, part of the game. It's like really, really boring. All you have to do is just sit there. You know, I'll be like stealth and stuff. Oh, it's about to look. So once we get our sword, it's going to be a lot more easier. And sadly, when we get our sword, it's just going to be that part where it's about to end. And who knows if we get to save our sister. Well, it's probably pretty obvious that we won't. So. Alright, come on. Go. Oh, my goodness. Just move. Go. Go. Leave. 
It said leave. Okay, good. Just gonna drop this here, and we're going to leave. Alright. So there's those bats over there, but you just want to ignore them. And this mice over there, but we want to ignore them too. And we're going to grab this barrel. And we're about to head to the second floor. Which is where we want to go. God, that, that actually scared me. Alright, hurry up. Um... Hurry up! Oh my god. This is why it's so annoying. It's it's like you have to go super duper slow. Um just hurry up. Leave. Good. Alright. Now you just make a run for it. Let's go. And there's that, but then wait. There's a chest over here. And then we get a yellow rupee. Not too shabby. Oh, crud. Wait. Okay, here we go. So we head up the ladders here. We're just gonna do a little bit of parkour involved. Oh. Wow. Um. Yeah, so we're just gonna head up the ladders here. And then we're going to do what the wise Nico taught us. No! What the heck? No. I, oh, I hate that. Apparently we failed the wise Nico. He's not that wise, but still. Okay. Let's just go here. And... Oh yeah, there's a door there. But, we want to head up here. And we actually made it this time. And what you can do... See right there. That's where we're supposed to head. Then Tetra here is just going to be like, Ha! I've got it, Link. In order to reach the top of the tower where your sister is being held, you'll have to find the room right below the tower. you got to take the door to the outside and then climb up from there. Got that? Okay, so yeah, that's one of those times when she's just like, Okay, use this. And this box will help you create... Shortcut, I, if I recall, where is that shortcut? Come on. Wait. Should be here somewhere. I mean, if I remember correctly. Um. Wait. Is that box useless? I think it is useless. Okay, let's just head on here. Wait. Wait for it. What am I doing right now? Okay, so it's gonna be the second floor. Yeah, okay, let's just let's just go here. So, um there's the mob ones, and we are just going to take that box and do that. Hey guys, it's FireSnakeX8 here, and welcome back to some more Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. Last time, we uh, went on Tetra's ship and got the messenger bag, or whatever it's called. Yeah, and we got launched all the way to here and lost our sword. And as you know, Link's sister, Errol, is here, locked up. So, what we're going to do is be all stealthy and stuff, and head... Up the tower to where our sister's hidden. Uh, I mean, um, captured. So we're just gonna. So whenever um, the light is, the uh, spotlight's on you, you just stop while you're in this barrel so they don't catch you. And I think. Let me just drop this, hopefully. Oh, wait, okay, so we're gonna head up here now. And this is where one of the spotlights are, because basically we're just going to disarm them. And... what? No. Yeah, one's right here. Okay. 
This is gonna be like... Listen up, there's a monster running the searchlight up there. If you can slay that monster, then just maybe it'll shut the searchlight down. Okay. So we're just gonna have to use our shield because we don't have our sword. So we're just gonna learn the ways of stealing other people's weapons. So what are we going to do? Let's see if we can sneak up on him. And... Grab that pot. Then... Going to Z target on him. Throw oh ah oh, I was supposed to throw it on you. Alright, come on, come on, bro. Alright. So this time you have to attack with A only. Cause ah, oh, come on, really? Let me pick that up. Let me beat you with my stick. It's probably the most stupidest thing ever, but hey. And then we can just chuck it by pressing B. And we get a joy pendant. Now, these are actually pretty useful, so we're going to have to um, store them later on. But um, there's an item that will actually be very, very helpful for us later on. So we'll just use that. So don't worry about these right now, because they're not that important. Now, we're going to... Da, 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 in this room. So there's also a heart piece in in this area, which we'll I'll probably get later. Actually, I might not. Yeah, yeah, I'm not. I'm just going to drop down there. So we're just going to head up here, and hopefully... There we go. So we're just going to head in this room. And we get this chest, and it's the map, you know, thing that we really use. Okay, and we're just going to chuck this, chuck this, we're just going to step on here, and when we enter this room, we will get a heart piece, which is pretty weird. Alright, yeah. So here's the heart piece, and we're now going this room because we can't get up there again. Anyways, really? Okay. Just ignore the mouse. That was close. So yeah, we're just gonna have to be all stealthy with the moblins too, because you know. And then they're gonna have that weird drum roll sound whenever they they're about to spot you. So just like, do not move when you hear that. Oh my God! Really? See, this is why I hate this segment the most. It's so annoying. You just have to sit there and wait in a barrel when you could have just used your sword. Shoot. I like how Link, like, stretches his hands up. Alright, whatever. Well, at least I could show you how to get out. And we're not that far from here. So just gonna jump up here. We're gonna grab this pot and throw it. And there's something else in here, right? Okay. Then we're just gonna crawl into this hole and come on. Come on. Alright, and then we get out here. Okay, so head over here, which is where we originally were, because there's no other way to get out. And then oh, Okay, wait, no, I just drop down here, then, oh shoot, that was, that was scary, alright, I see you, okay, Come on. oh, okay. really, you had to be there when I came, Hmm. Really? Aw, oh, come on. Really? No, this isn't fair. I was doing so good a few minutes ago, like, before I was started recording it. That just sucks. Alright. At least we get a five. 
five rupees, but not, oh, that discount. I thought your max wallet would be five right now. Uh, I mean, hundred right now, but still. We're just gonna go here. We're gonna do the same exact slow thing over and over and over. It's really annoying. All right. Come on. Oh. Ha! I have the barrel now. Take that. Oh. Shoot. I'm supposed to wait. Come on. Hey, this is just kind of tedious. It's it's not that hard to do. You just have to be really, really patient. Come on. You didn't see anything, Mr. Moblin. Okay, that scared me. Come on, hurry up! I don't have that time to, to wait. Oh my god. Hey, look, walking barrel. There we go, he looked, okay. Come on, hurry up. Really? It's gonna take such a long time. Look, look that way. Come on. Alright, here we go. So we're gonna head here and just stay stay here because he's gonna turn his back. He's gonna walk that way. Nope. Oh. <sighs> Finally. We're here. Alright. I'm just gonna go up here. Ignore the mini blends, they're gonna do that. But oh yeah, um so yeah, recently Nintendo held that Ah, oh, come on okay, you know what? No, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Screw you guys. But yeah, Nintendo held their Nintendo Direct thing. And they were able to announce Majora's Mask 3D, and I was, like, pretty happy about that, but kind of sad, because, well, you know, it's not, it's not Majora's Mask HD, so that was, that was pretty sad. Alright, now, so we head out here. Seagulls are up there. But wait! Ah, uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um... Let me think. Oh, yeah, let's go back in here. We don't want to go out right now. Because we already covered that part. Alright, anyways, so... Let's see. Oh, yeah, this way. Yeah, this way. Okay. Let's go this way. So it's another one of those boring segments. Really, you didn't need to look. Alright. Just just pass by me. I'll be very, very hap happy. Come on. Really? Come on, hurry up. Yeah. What? Really? Really? Again? Okay. Alright. Now's our chance. We can head out here. And, oh yeah, there's that down there, but... That's for another time. Alright. So, we're gonna go here and here. My god, there's nothing really that much to talk about. Okay, there's another Moblin. And... I'm just gonna hide behind this billboard. Let's see if we can... Hurry up. Alright, good. And we head out here. And... Then there's gonna be this magical... 
Moblin that can shoot laser eyes, but that doesn't matter, because here's our second chest. I mean, third chest. Yeah, third chest. Alright, so we get ten rupees, and then we head up here. Maybe. Wait, let me see. I think we should head out here first. Alright, never mind. That's a dead end. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, but still. So we're just gonna head back in there and head up the ladders. Because, yeah. Why not? And then, from that point, you really don't need to worry about that moblin that shoots laser eyes, because, yeah. And if you head back here, I do not remember what will happen. Alright. So we're going to go here, and up the ladder. Come on, up the ladder. Yeah, this is where one of the searchlights are. Come on. Hmm. Come on, let me hit you. Ha ha. Alright. Let's beat him up. Of course, he's using melee combat. Come on. There we go. I th yeah, we, we, we killed him. Alright, let's see. What next? Alright, wait. No. Yep, right here. Okay, let's just drop. Doesn't really matter that much, but okay. Um, let's go through here, I guess. And oh yeah, it's this area. So um, actually no, let's go back through here, then go through there. Oh my god, I am so uncertain right now. All right, through here. No, oh my god, I am doing terrible right now. <sighs> All right, so we're just gonna head through here. Okay, now I'm certain, because last time I went through here, I was thinking that I missed a bunch of stuff, which I probably did, because we still haven't gotten in the compass yet. So I am really, no! Ah. That's, that was bad. Okay. Anyways. We just had three. Oh my god. Wood as pillows. That, that is, that is really sad. Poor moblins and coblins. Maybe they're just misunderstood. I really shouldn't beat them up. Okay. Yes, we made it. Okay, good. And. Alright, we should be here. And, yeah, so if we go through here, we are getting closer. And, if you look through here, that's where we're supposed to head. So Tetra's gonna be like, okay, aha, I got it, Link. In order to reach the top of the tower where your sister's being held, you'll have to find the room right below the tower. Yeah, so basically it's just showing to go where that small cutscene was showing you. Okay. Alright, so then we're going to head through here. And... Just... Yeah, so this is probably the last stealth part. No, I don't think it's the last one, though, but... Alright. Come on. Make your move. Can I just move? Oh, now you see. Okay. Okay. 
Really? Can you just let me go? Alright, you guys can please go. There's nothing to see here. It's just a barrel. That somehow teleported here. Nothing to see. Okay, good. Okay, good. I don't know why I'm heading through here. I just want to disable that last um, search light thing right there. That one. So yeah, that's technically where you're supposed to head. I just... Yeah, I went through there. Alright, let me just head over to... Um, shut down the last spotlight. And then we're gonna head through those ginormous doors. Because I do not know what went, what went wrong. Oh my god. If I fail... That, that would have been so sad. Because... Then I have to go all the way back up. That would be even worse. Alright, there we are. And we're going to head over to the final spotlight search thingy. I don't know what to call it. Nope, don't look. Nothing to see here. And we're going to do the usual thing and throw the pots at them. Ah, he heard the Z target sound effect. Okay. Really? Oh, crap. Okay, here. We're just going to use our shield. It hits, and then we he loses it. Then we hit him. Then we hit him again. That's what you get. Sleeping on block pillows. Wooden pillows, I mean. And we get our heart. Then, we just jump down here, and, go here, and go back to here, and we are going to be almost done. We are finally so close. So close. Oh wait, let me let me do this. I forgot to do it. All right. So there's a shortcut. So you can just push this block here, and now you can push that over to the ladder, and then you can get back up here anytime. So that won't be a pain in the butt to get all the way up to that room. See, just like that, and we made it. Wait, am I going the back? No, I'm going the wrong way. No, so stupid. Okay, let me go back here. Then we're gonna go over here and make it for once in life. We're gonna make it. I still feel like I forgot something, I just don't know what. This is gonna be so sad. So then the Moblin's gonna be like, haha, I found you. Then I'm gonna be like, no, okay. So we're just gonna. Stand. Oh. Come on, just, just. Wow, that would be scary to drop there, okay. Haha, ha, in your face. Okay. We're up here. And we're finally going to make it. We just have to head up these steps. Again. And the final stealth part. Come on, don't look here.
Alright. There's nothing to worry about there. I think that's about it. And we are finally going to get our sword. But first, which is kind of sad, we're going to have to siddle here. Alright, this is going to take a while. We can already hear the seagulls. Alright, whatever. Yep, there's the seagulls. Alright. So we're going to settle here again. And we're totally going to need two hearts, because what we're going to fight is probably the biggest threat in the whole entire world. And you'll see what I mean. And it's not the big giant bird. And it's not Ganondorf. It's this thing. Right there. So you're gonna go fight it. And Link find- oh. Nope. Victory dance. Alright. Go grab our sword. Finally got to uh, get our sword back. And we get to kill him. Then we get that awesome mini boss music. Come on. Die! Oh. And he's dead. And that opens up. So then, grab this rupee. And since we can't go back, I guess we're going to have to go here. Now what lies here is something very, very evil. Something that no man can ever defeat. That person. is Link's sister. The most annoyingest thing in the world. Wait, plot twist. Not really. The bird's here. And we have to fight it. Let's fight it. Not really. Gonna fly all over the tower. Then it's gonna go over here. And here we meet. The okay bad guy. By saying okay, he actually did a good thing by stealing our sister. Now, who is this person? Um, you'll have to find out in the next part.